How to grow lucky bamboo in water. Welcome to Garden Bamboo Plants. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon so you won't miss any of our exciting plant care tips. In this video, we'll be talking all about how to grow lucky bamboo in water and provide care tips that lucky bamboo growers should know. Growing lucky bamboo in water. Did you know that lucky bamboo is not actually bamboo at all? It's a type of plant that can be grown in water or soil. If you choose to grow it in water, there are a few things you need to keep in mind. Lucky bamboo can be sensitive to chemicals, especially chlorine, in tap water. To avoid this, you can use bottled, distilled, filtered, or rainwater. Alternatively, you can leave tap water to stand for 24 hours at room temperature to let the chlorine evaporate. Does lucky bamboo grow better in water or soil? Some of you may be wondering whether lucky bamboo grows better in water or soil. Well, it's a water-loving succulent, evergreen plant, so it can thrive in both media. However, growing it in soil provides better root support and reduces the risk of root rot and algal growth. But if you decide to grow it in water, don't worry, it will still thrive just fine. The video linked above provides invaluable information on how to supercharge lucky bamboo growth. Check it out! Step-by-step -step guide to growing lucky bamboo in water. Now, let's get our hands dirty and learn how to grow lucky bamboo in water step-by-step. Step. step 1. Prepare the vessel. Clean your watertight container with dish soap or bleach and warm water. Rinse it thoroughly and let it dry before use. Step 2. Take lucky bamboo stem cuttings. Trim healthy cuttings from the mother plant, ensuring at least one leaf joint is present at the end of each cutting. Step 3. Trim the cuttings. Remove the leaves from the bottom of the stem, leaving 2 to 3 inches of bare stem cutting below the waterline. Step 4. Rooting Lucky Bamboo Cuttings. Fill the container with distilled or filtered water, making sure the bottom of the cuttings is fully submerged. Rooting hormones can be used to promote faster root growth. Step 5. Provide optimum propagation conditions. Keep the water fresh, provide filtered light, and maintain slightly warmer temperatures to encourage root growth. Step 6. Transfer your rooted lucky bamboo. Once the roots have formed, transfer your lucky bamboo to a clean vase with fresh water and decorative pebbles for added support and aesthetics. Tips for making your lucky bamboo thrive in water. Now that you've got your lucky bamboo growing in water let's ensure it thrives and stays happy. Tip number 1. Change water weekly. Regularly changing the water prevents the growth of harmful microorganisms and keeps your plant healthy. Tip number 2. Provide proper lighting. Lucky Bamboo loves bright, indirect sunlight. Avoid dark corners or direct sunlight, and your plant will grow faster and healthier. Tip number 3. Maintain proper humidity and temperature. Keep your plant away from drafts, hot or cold, and maintain average humidity and temperatures for best growth. Tip number 4. Occasional fertilization. Use a weak liquid fertilizer occasionally, but only if the leaves turn yellow, as too much fertilizer can harm the plant. Tip number 5. Use distilled or filtered water, avoid using tap water unless it's left to stand for 24 hours to let the chlorine evaporate. Tip number 6. Rotate your lucky bamboo, turning or rotating your plant in front of a light source will encourage even growth and shape. The video linked above provides invaluable information on how to revive lucky bamboo leaves turning yellow. Check it out. Common problems and fixes. Now, let's address some common issues you might face while growing lucky bamboo in water. Problem number one. Yellowing leaves. If your lucky bamboo's leaves turn yellow, it might be receiving too much sunlight or fertilizer. Move it to a shadier spot and reduce the fertilizer. Problem number two. Lucky bamboo dying in water. Several factors can contribute to this, but most can be resolved by replacing the pebbles and changing the water. Problem number three. Black roots. Trim black roots and change the water to address this issue. If you have any other problems with your lucky bamboo in water, leave them in the comments so that we can help you address them in our next video update. Top tip for growing lucky bamboo in water. Regularly replacing the water is crucial to maintain its health and vitality. By changing the water, we prevent the buildup of harmful microorganisms, eliminate toxins, and provide the plant with fresh nutrients. Stagnant water can lead to root rot and other issues that may harm the plant's overall growth. Fresh water ensures the plant's roots remain healthy and allows for better absorption of nutrients, contributing to the longevity and beauty of our beloved lucky bamboo. 
Remember, Lucky Bamboo can live for one to two years in water, but it can thrive even longer if you take good care of it. If you found this guide helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. Don't forget to subscribe to the Garden Bamboo Plants channel for more Lucky Bamboo care tips. Happy Bamboo Growing!